Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel again. General Technology Knowledge. Today I would like to show and share about PRC S Ven 200 that we will uh, focus to the EM in mean that expansion module 235. Okay. In the previous video, we already learned about uh, analog expansion module also, but the module is 231, yeah, that it has AI4 and 12-bit uh, and no uh, AQ, okay. So uh, today we will learn about the module. Yes, analog output module and input module. We can say uh, this one we can use both analog input and analog output. Okay. So first, I will uh, explain a little bit about the connection. If we connect this module to the CPU 224HP CN we can count from AQW4 from here that uh, we can use both voltage and uh, milliamp for signal output okay and for the onboard CPU it also stick the analog output one channel also that we can uh, start from address AQW0 that uh, similar to be here yes we can use 0 to 10 volt or we can use 0 to 20 milliamp also okay and for analog input on board, we can use 0 to 10 volt 2 channels on board CPU. Okay. And when we uh, connect it like this, for M is uh, negative, yes, negative volt, or we can say minus. And here is plus voltage. Okay. And for expansion module, it start count from AI4. Yes. Let's see here AI0, AI2, AI4 until AI10. Okay. So if we uh, connect it like this, we can use 10 channels for analog input and 2 channels for analog output. Okay. To uh, easy to understand, uh, let's go to our program to write program and test with the analog input of expansion module and analog output of expansion module. And I will uh, test with the voltage and current also for analog output and for input I uh, will use only current yes for a source the input okay so uh, before go to our program I would like to explain more a little bit about the drawing of this module okay so let's go So uh, to see the drawing, let's go here and then I will explain, yes. Okay, here is the drawing of EM235 module, analog combination between four inputs and one output, okay. Let's see here, if we would like to use the wall for input, we can use only this terminal, yes. 
we can connect from uh, A plus and A minus. A minor is uh, voltage minus and A plus is uh, voltage plus. Okay. And uh, if we would like to use the current, we can use 0 to 20 milliamp, but we need to jump this uh, connection. Yes, jump this terminal also. That's why I uh, connect the standard source to here, but jumping the terminal AR, sorry, uh, a, A, and uh, A plus, okay, for uh, plus milliamp. And for analog output here, M, you see M zero. It means that uh, common, yes, between volt and current. If we would like to connect from here, we can use uh, minus. And this is a volt. 0 to 10 volt and here is 0 to uh, 20 milliamp okay and here is the dip speed yes okay I will explain a little bit for uh, dip speed yeah configuration let's see the dip speed yes here configuration dip speed and here is the gain yes Gain is uh, adjust a little bit for uh, analog that uh, accuracy is error a little bit so we can adjust the gain and offset to be uh, the same okay so here okay let's see the em to 3 5 right here is the dip speed let's see if we configuration like this, we can use 0 to 50 millivolt, okay? And if we would like to use the 0 to uh, 20 milliamp, we can push this on, off, 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 and on for uh, deep speed number 1 and deep speed number 6, okay? And if we would like to use 0 to 10 volt, we can off, on, off, 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 and on. Yes, like this. So the standard signal, we can use both. Yeah, we can use all of these by selecting the configuration deep speed. Okay. So uh, let's go to our program to write program for test. Yes, the analog. Okay, let's go to step 7 microbin. Yes. Right now I use uh, version uh, 4, so we page 9. Yes. Okay, to uh, create the analog, let's see, the, write some comment. Test analog. Input and output. module em235 right okay so uh, I will use move yes so before use move uh, let's see uh, we need to all way on yes so sm20 sorry 0, 0 and choose the move word Yes. So uh, right now I already connected from the input from this terminal. So I will use the AI W4 and I already connected uh, analog output AQW4 from uh, this terminal. It means that uh, current. Yes. And this one uh, current also. So uh, I will use AIW4 and then output AQW4, okay?
so let's go so here I can use a I W 4 yes and move value to a I W 4 also sorry a Q W 4 also okay like this and uh, let open yes check the communication port yes between uh, my computer and PLC yes right now it found uh, one CPU HP sorry uh, 224 HP yes we are at rest 2 and baud rate 9.6 kilobyte per sec yes so uh, let click download to download the sample program to the POC yes remote to okay let communication again okay and then let uh, download error 2 error detect compilation okay let me check why error this one error AIW4 yes actually we need to compile yes error 0 so uh, we can download Okay, downloading the program successfully. Okay, so uh, let online and check. Okay, so uh, I will adjust the milliamp from uh, the standard source to let's see the current. Yes, in and out. Okay, so. Uh, Right now, I will adjust the milliamp to 4 milliamp. Yes, 4 milliamp, the raw data around 6000 a little bit. Yes, okay. So let me adjust to 0 milliamp first. Okay, 0 milliamp. I will adjust the standard soft to 0 milliamp. Yes, around uh, 0. 0.25 yes so uh, it not zero okay so error a little bit because uh, my standard saw is not zero also so uh, let test okay uh, right now, I already connected the standard source 0 to 20 milliamp here. Yes. And uh, here is the analog output that I already connected from the multimeter to measure the current. Yes. You see, current DC. Yes. And uh, I will adjust the standard saw. Yes. Okay. You see the current is uh, varied. Yes. Current is varied. So I will adjust to uh, 12 milliamp. Yes, 12 milliamp something. You see the raw data is uh, varied also. If I adjust to uh, 20 milliamp. Yes, you see the output is very also, yes, 20 million, around 32,000 something, yes, so it is okay. So if we would like to uh, measure the voltage for analog uh, output, we can use this terminal, yes, okay, I will show. It will be uh, 0 to 10 volt, yes, let me show. So wait a moment, I will uh, connect the multimeter. Yes.
Okay, uh, right now I will adjust the milliamp to zero first to make sure it's zero volt or not. Yes. Okay, it nearly zero volt. Yes. The rank is zero to ten volt. So if I adjust to uh, twenty milliamp, yes, go to twenty milliamp. Yes, the voltage is 10, yes, right now, 10 volt DC, yes. So, uh, we can use both uh, volt and uh, current from this analog output by uh, follow the dip switch, yes, let's see dip switch. So this is an instruction how to uh, connect and test the analog module of PLC S Van 200 by using the standard source and measure the current and volt by use multimeter. Okay, and uh, for this module we can also uh, select the dip speed by uh, using the configuration and adjust the analog by using this scan and offset. If it uh, error a little bit, so we can adjust. Yes. So thank you very much for watching my video, and I hope this video will uh, explain to everyone that use this uh, PLC module yes and I'm also sorry if I have mistake in this video because my English is not so good so uh, I'm also sorry if I have mistake and I would like to request all of you to like share and subscribe my channel also to get more notification and more new videos that I will create step by step. And if everyone have any question, please drop comment under my video. I will reply soon. So in this time, I would like to say thank you very much again and see you next videos. Bye bye.